we are going to discuss about the hormonal regulation of male as well as female reproductive system right so what are the various hormones that are involved in the male reproductive system as well as female reproductive system we will see the list of the hormones and their specific functions and we will also see how these hormones regulate the male as well as female reproductive system so first we will be discussing the hormonal control of the male reproductive system so the two major hormones are fsh and ic and icsh fsh that is follicular stimulating hormone this hormone is responsible for the stimulation and production or regulation of germinal epithelial cells so fsh is responsible for stimulation and regulation of germinal epithelial cells this is the first hormone which is the most important hormone that regulates the entire male reproductive system in conjunction with the other hormones the second hormone is icsh that is interstitial cell stimulating hormone these hormones stimulate ladies cells to secrete androgens so icsh s i c s x stands for interstitial cell stimulating hormone interstitial cell stimulating hormone the role of this hormone is to stimulate ladies cells so this hormone stimulate ladies cells now what are the various changes that are observed under the influence of both these hormones so the first change that is when follicular stimulating hormone is stimulating the germinal epithelial cells then germ cells will be activated when germ cells get activated they undergo meiosis to produce the gametes so it is changes first change when the follicular stimulating hormone is activated it activates or stimulates germinal epithelial cells right so what is the effect germ cells undergo meiosis to produce gamete and the gamete is what we call it as sperm cell now what is the effect or what is the change when icsh is stimulated or when this hormone is activated it stimulates ladies cells to secrete the male sex hormone androgens and the most common is testosterone so when interstitial cell stimulating hormone stimulates ladies cell the effect is ladies cell secretes an important androgen that is male sex hormone and the name of the hormone is testosterone testosterone we know this testosterone is responsible for secondary sexual behavior or secondary sexual character in case of males so what we have discussed so far the two important hormones follicular stimulating hormone interstitial cell stimulating hormone this hormone stimulates and regulates the growth of the germinal epithelial cells when this is activated the germ cells undergo meiosis to produce the male gamete that is the sperm cell via a process that is what we call it as spermatogenesis and that is what we have already seen spermatogenesis the next cell is interstitial cell stimulating hormone the role of this hormone is to stimulate the ladies cells and we have also studied during the male reproductive system that when the ladies cells are activated they get stimulated by the pituitary gland they start secreting the androgens which is a male sex hormone that is testosterone and this testosterone is responsible for secondary sexual characters if you remember when we were discussing regarding the details of the male reproductive system we have studied some conical cells and that was sertoli cells right so in the germinal epithelium conical cells were present these conical cells are called as sertoli cells and 
the main role also bigger business. Sertoli cells provide nourishment or nutrition to the developing sperm cells. Now these Sertoli cells produce two different types of proteins. The first one is androgen binding protein A, B, B. So this Sertoli cells secretes Starts to appear. Broadening of the shoulder, high or 
also increases. That is increase height is also ups. So all of these are the changes that takes place during the puberty phase of males. So now let us see this entire process in one schematic diagram. So that is going to help you out. So anterior pituitary is there. The two important hormones FSH, ICSH. So, follicular stimulating hormone, interstitial cell stimulating hormone that is ICSH. Now, what happens when ICSH is stimulated? It activates the lady cells. So, activates lady cells. When these lady cells are activated, they start producing androgens. So, Production of androgens that is the male sex hormone, and the example is testosterone. And this testosterone is responsible for secondary sexual characters in male. In all these secondary sexual characters, we have already seen. Now, what about this FSH? Follicular stimulating. When this hormone is activated, it is going to stimulate Sertoli cells. Now why FSH is stimulating the Sertoli cells? Because Sertoli cells are those cells which will produce two different types of proteins. The first protein is androgen binding protein and inhibit protein. Inhibit protein decreases the secretion. So it is acting as a negative feedback mechanism. So when it is stimulating the Sertoli cells, Sertoli cells start producing two different types of hormones that is androgen binding protein that is ABP androgen binding protein and inhibit. Inhibit do what? It inhibits. <coughs> 